Good morning, boys and girls. I'm so happy you're joining us today in Sabbath School. Let's just start singing good morning to each one of you, and I'm coming to say good morning, and I hope that you will be willing to shake hands with our little puppet here in Sabbath School. It's going to join us this morning. Let's sing song number one. Let's find our bells in our basket and let's sing Sabbath bells are ringing. Oh, I love to hear the Sabbath bells ringing early on Sabbath morning. Ready? Yes, good job. Well, boys and girls, um, Jesus is my friend, and he is with us every day, all day long, every day of the week, and we're going to be talking a lot about um, every day of the week on Sabbath School this morning. Let's find our flags and sing, I have a friend, who's na who, um, a friend who loves me. <sighs> to know that Jesus is with us all week long. Now, boys and girls, it is time to gather our offering. So let's come and put our offering in our basket while we sing song number four. <laughs>
pray for our offerings. Let's gather around our baskets and let's get ready by singing song number five. Thank you, Jesus, for the Sabbath day, and thank you so much for all the things that you created. You created our world and the animals and our families. Thank you so much, dear Jesus. In Jesus we pray. Amen. Well, today we're going to talk about all the wonderful things that God and Jesus made for us. He made us very special so that we can walk and we can sit and we can play and we can jump. Now, let's stand up in front of our chairs and do the actions to the song number six. Let's sing all together. a wonderful story today for you but all the things that Jesus and God made now a long time ago this world was nothing but darkness oh boy can you see anything I don't see anything at all but God made on the first day light and this was light looks like <gasps> That's right. That is right. Now, boys and girls, the teacher is going to give you a flashlight so you can just play with the, with the light while we sing song number seven. Oh, see, boys and girls, you have some lights with you. Let's just uh, sing song number seven. Did you like to play with that light? So cool, right? Oh, I'm so glad that Jesus made us the light because otherwise it would be so, so dark and we couldn't see anything, anything at all. Well, you know what? On the second day, this is the first day here, he made the light because everything was dark. And on the second day, boys and girls, God created the air that we breathe. Um, we need air to keep us alive, and, and the plants need air, and the animals need air, and God on that day created the air. So he separated the water from the, the, from the top and the, and, and, and the bottom and created the wonderful air. Now, boys and girls, I love to play with air. Would you like to play with air? Teacher's going to give you a pinwheel that we can just 
Spin like this. Oh, boys and girls, this is a lot of fun to play. And let's sing song number eight while you're trying to probably play with your pinwheel. to play with this yes thank you thank you so much yeah we're helping daddy too yeah thank you right boys and girls also on the second day on the second day god separated the waters so he put waters over here and the rest that is also a water is a mist it's the firmament that's what we call it and he did that on the second day now at, at the bottom of the ocean the water it had the sand and we can find shells um, if you would like we can try to help to find some shells here at the bottom of the waters if you can find some seashells Sometimes going to the ocean is so much fun to find all the seashells in there. Now, boys and girls, besides the land, God made the second day and he made water for us to drink, to wash our clothes, to bathe. We can get water for all of that. So, boys and girls, um... Nietzsche is going to come around and get you some water so you can feel the wet water while we sing song number 10. that Jesus made the water because we all need to drink a lot of water. We need it to make us feel comfortable and healthy. Now, boys and girls, on the third day, God 
separated the waters to the dry land. So he had dry land, and then the sea was over there, away from the dry land. And on the dry land, he put grass, and he put trees, boys and girls. And, um, oh, we love all these kinds of trees that he made. And um, let's sing song number 11, and let's sway like a tree in the gentle breeze. Let's stand up, all boys and girls, and let's sing together. boys and girls that's what the tree does when the gentle breeze is blowing they just swayed but think of Nathan found a pretty flower on the third day also God made all those beautiful flowers he made them all different different colors different shapes because God likes so many different things artistic so boys and girls while we sing song number 12 will you please come and get one of these flowers and take it with you to your basket you can show it to your mom your dad yep let's come and get one right here wonderful Jesus and God that made such a beautiful things. Now, boys and girls, um, some of the trees and bushes um, that me, Jesus made makes, gave us food to eat. Yes, like lots of the tree, trees and bushes have apples or oranges or mangoes. Or we have some berries in the bushes like strawberries, blueberries. Now, boys and girls, you have some food in your baskets. Can you please come and bring it here to our basket while we sing song number 13? <laughs> to eat look oranges they are so good pears and so many different things that Jesus made for us to eat oh thank you Jesus um, well you know what boys and girls on the fourth day oh my goodness on the fourth day God created the Sun and the Sun helped us to um, to help the plants to grow 
and the fruits to ripe and getting really nice and good and the flowers to look beautiful and healthy. Now we have some sunglasses in our baskets. Let's wear sunglasses while we sing song number 14. <laughs> Jesus made this sunshine. We really need that. But you know what, boys and girls? He also, on the fourth day, um, the sunshine gives a beautiful light during the day. But you know what? God created sunshine at night too. God made the moon and the stars. Yes, and they all, you can see them at night, boys and girls. Now, um, you have some uh, star ones in your baskets that you can just wave and twinkle, twinkle, twinkle like they do at night while we sing song number 15. <laughs> the beautiful starts at night that twinkle right boys and girls oh I'm you can just put them back in you like that right yeah so you can put it back in your baskets now boys and girls on the fifth day whoa we're moving along the fifth day God created something that lives in the water boys and girls what would that be Lots and lots of fish. And God made them to look different. Look. Some of them are bigger. Some of them are smaller. Some of them have stripes. Some of them have different colors and dots. And boys and girls, they are beautiful. And they fill our oceans with lots and fish. Now, boys and girls, you have a fish in your basket that you can come and bring right here while we sing song number 16. <laughs> God's made something that flies in the air. What could that be? 
That's right, birds. All kinds of birds and different colors. Some are big, some are little. We have different birds over here, like an eagle and parrot. So many different birds because God loves things that are different. He's so creative and makes beautiful things. Now, boys and girls, I think you have a bird in your basket that you can help him. You put him in your finger and help him to fly in Sabbath school class like this while we sing song number 17. Mine is blue, but I see that some of your birds are yellow too. Beautiful different colors and they fly and they sing beautiful song. Now boys and girls, we, God came to the sixth day and on the sixth day of the week, God was so busy, boys and girls. He was so busy. He made lots and lots of animals. Now, this is a special animal. Look at this one. This is one of the animals that God created. And this is a kangaroo. And kangaroo has long, big legs on the back, tiny ones on the front. They have a pouch and they carry their baby there. Yes, they are from the marsupials family and they love to hop. They cannot walk and they cannot run. They just hop, 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 hop like that. Now, boys and girls, let's stand up with me and let's hop like a kangaroo while we sing song number 18. <laughs> you, Nathan. You did very well hopping like a kangaroo. Good job. Now, boys and girls, oh dear. Oh, thank you. <laughs> he still wants to hop. He wants to help. Yeah. Oh, boys and girls, let me tell you. Oh, God was so busy on the sixth day. He made the fun kangaroos and he made so many other animals. You know what, boys and girls? He made the long, beautiful giraffes and lions and zebras. He also made the kitty cats like this one. And God made also, oh, I love this, pandas. Oh, God really did himself on, on the sixth day making all these animals. Now, boys and girls, while we sing song number 19, you may come and grab one of these animals that you like and you can go and sit with your animal, okay? 
Let's sing song number 19 and you may come and get one of them. She loves her panda. Oh, I saw that also. You got some koalas. Oh, beautiful little koalas. And an orangutan. Oh, so many different animals. And they're beautiful. Yes, and we are to care for them and love them and make sure that they are okay. Oh, the, what a nice job God gave us, right, boys and girls? Now, you know what? The best, besides the animals, God made something else on the sixth day. And this was the most favorite thing that he created all week long. And you know what it was, boys and girls? It was people. He made the first man, and his name is Adam, and he made his wife, the first woman, Eve. And the boys and girls, um, and guess what? He also made your mom and your dad and you and your brothers and sisters and all of, all of us. And what a wonderful thing that he made. Now, boys and girls, let's sing song number 20. And let's stand up and do our motions with this song. Let's sing song number 20. boys and girls God made each one of us very special and different we are tall people and short people and dark people and clyde people they're all long hair short hair blue eyes dark eyes God made all of us thank you I think that you like this twinkle light right <laughs> yes God made us all of us and he made us different so boys and girls he made us so we can also, all of us can run, and we can jump, and we can walk. We can do all those things. Is he a wonderful Jesus? Let's all stand up and do the motions with this. Song 21. <laughs> again. I can stand up tall like this, like this, oh, I can stand up tall, Jesus made me that way. I can jump up high like this, like this, oh, I can jump up high, Jesus made me that way. Oh, 
Good job. You guys did great. Well, let me tell you, boys and girls, the week is not over. God had something very special. And on the seventh day, you know here, boys and girls, on the seventh day, God didn't do anything. He rested from all the work that he made. It was a special day, and it was called the Sabbath. And Sabbath is when we worship God and learn more about him. He made um, days, uh, uh, he made everything in six days. But on the seventh day, he rested and he wants to spend them with you and me. Isn't that wonderful, boys and girls? Now, let's hold up our fingers while we count on to number seven. Let's see, let's practice that. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven. Now let's practice this thing, this song number um, 22, and let's use our fingers to count of the days of the week. makes me so very, very happy. Now, you know what? We have a special story today, and it is time for our story time. Let's sing song number 24 while we get ready for our story time. Sabbath boys and girls and I'm excited that we're going to have our story soon so let's sing song number 24 while we get ready for our story time. <laughs>
Good, good morning, boys and girls. I'm so happy to see all of you here. And you know our stories have been about baby Jesus because we just had Christmas, right? And we were celebrating baby Jesus being born. But you know what? Baby Jesus grew up just like you and me. And he got bigger. So let's see what baby Jesus, now that he's a big boy, does. Oh, there's Jesus. He's gotten bigger just like you guys. Yes, and he sleeps at night. And when he wakes up in the morning, oh, he stretches. Oh, it's a new day. Oh, I can't wait to see what I get to do today. But you know what? Jesus, before he starts the day, he kneels down. And he says a prayer. Dear God, please help me to listen and be a happy helper today. I love you. Amen. Oh, my goodness. So he says, how can I be a happy helper today? Well, I don't know about you boys and girls, but one of my favorite things is to go outside. And Jesus loved to go outside. And he learned about God and outside. He saw the goats. <laughs> oh, and he would pet them and help feed them. Oh, he loved to help take care of the animals. And what did he see up in the trees? Tweet, 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 tweet. Did he see some birds in the trees? Oh, yes. He loved being outside. Did you hear it? Tweet, tweet. Yeah. Oh, he heard the birds and the goats. And he loved to be outside. But you know what else he liked to learn about God? God from the Bible, too. So let's see what he did. He didn't go to school like some of you do. He went to school at home. So he would come in from outside, and his mom would read to him. Oh, yes, let's see. She would read. Let's find the Bible. She would read from the scroll. But it was just kind of like our Bible. She would read stories to boy Jesus. Yes, and oh, he loved to hear stories about God and how creation, just like we talked about the seven days. Oh, he learned so much from his mom. But you know what else he did inside? He was a helper. Oh, yes. His friend would say, Jesus, come outside to play. Jesus would say, no, I'm helping mom. I'm sweeping the floor. Or maybe he was getting some water. Oh, they had big things to get water in. Maybe he was helping mom. And do you know who else he helped? Mom was Mary, but he also liked to help daddy. Daddy was named Joseph. Yes, and Joseph was a carpenter, and he had a hammer. He had a hammer, and he would work, and Jesus would help him. Oh, my goodness, yes. And you can hear him outside. Oh, yes. Joseph and Jesus were working hard. Oh, yes. Jesus was such a good helper to his mama Mary and to his daddy Joseph. All right, so six days Jesus is outside playing and helping and working. What happens on the seventh day? Do you remember? Oh. Oh, they heard the praise bow and the horn. Do you know what Jesus did? Just like you're doing today? He went to church and Sabbath school. Yes, he wanted to learn more. So just like you did, Jesus was a good helper, and he helped during the week, and then on Sabbath, he went to Sabbath school and church just like you did. Now, I want you guys to help me. Let's see some other ways we can be helpers, okay? Let's see. Oh, Ava, I see a girl here. <gasps> Can you run outside and help mom and daddy and get the mail at the mailbox? Oh, that's a way to help. Yes. Oh, uh, let's see. Ethan or Lucas, do you have any catty, kitty cats or puppy dogs at home? Let's see how we can help at home. 
Oh, yes. Let's give them some water to drink and some food to eat. Oh, so we can help Mommy and Daddy by feeding the animals. Oh, what about Elena? Do you ever have toys at Elena? Oh, my goodness. Do you ever help Mommy? Look at the toys. Let's put our toys. Let's pick them up. Oh, what a big helper for Mommy to pick up the toys. Nathan, my goodness, can you help outside too? Do you know what? Sometimes we need to sweep up because there's dirt, but I don't know about you guys. All the wind, there's lots of leaves everywhere. So Nathan can help rake the leaves. Oh my goodness. And you know what else we can do? When mommy and daddy get groceries, can we help them bring the groceries in and be a good, happy helper? And do you know what? We can be a helper all day long for mommy and daddy. And who, who do we like to thank for our good day and for helping us to be strong and to be able to help mommy and daddy? We want to thank Jesus. Can you help me say our Mimi verse to Jay? Mom, Jesus Mom, was Mom, obedient. Mom. What a big word. It means he was a happy helper. So when you go home today, I hope you can be a happy helper. And let's fold our hands and close our eyes and let's tell Jesus, thank you for a Sabbath day. Thank you so much for our Sabbath day and all our families, our boys and girls and mommies and daddies and grandmas and grandpas. And thank you for helping us to be happy helpers. Help us to be strong and listen to you. And when you say, go help, be helper, help us to do that. Thank you, Jesus. We love you. Amen. Wasn't that a beautiful story? Um, and today's a very special Sabbath, boys and girls. And uh, we invite you to stay for church because we're going to sing to Jesus and we're going to pray also. And um, we, that's always a fun time. Now, at the door, you will find a teacher may have the, the stories for you to take home. So mom or dad can read them to you or grandpa or grandma. You can also practice your memory verse. Yes, you can do all that. And you know what, boys and girls, if you're patient enough, teacher will come by and give you a sticker. That's right. I know you really like them. So, um... Let's sing song number 26, but um, if you want to wait a few minutes, the teacher will come by and give you the sticker. Let's sing number 26.
Sabbath, boys and girls.